Are you serious? <laughs> you have the audio of this shit with no camera? <laughs> Oh, we're recording. Yeah, we're going. Oh, we're live. All right, this is TTT Reacts episode. Who cares? We got our boy Jake Berman in the house. Max El Hodge. Uh, what does he call you? He didn't have a name. I was an abomination. You're an abomination. Of the menace. You're a menace. No, he, he, we're going to. He, he said Max El Hodge. Pull, pull up on oh, that yeah, mic. Yeah, yeah. Like a hag. Like, that's a. There you go. Sorry. I've Max heard, El yeah. Hag. Yeah, I've heard that before. And if you're wondering what we're talking about, let's just dive into it, shall we, boys? Yeah, so, let's do it. What brought us all here today? I didn't realize that Aunt Haynes was on this same podcast. Yeah, what? You didn't know that? Are you having Max L. Hag on tomorrow? Yes. Why? <laughs> Why? <clears throat> Max L. Hag over at the training think tub. Those guys, they're an abomination to the sport. Max L. Hag is an absolute menace. They have their own podcast, the Corpus Anus podcast. And I heard them say the most ridiculous things, like uh, like the Jake German is the the best in the burpees at CrossFit. And I just can't believe it was it. They me next to him in a burpee workout. This I would end this man's life. They should pray that he never has that fate. Um, I'll ask him. I'll ask him uh, tomorrow how they um, how they came to that conclusion that Jake German was uh, better than uh, molten curtains at. Um, <laughs> I, I, I would, I would be interested to know. He would be interested to know, and that's what we're going to spend the rest of this hour doing, <laughs> yeah. figuring out why. Uh, yeah, I'm interested. Why to would know. you say such a crazy thing? Oh, me say that? Well, I think we need to tell the people how this came to be. That's what I'm saying. We're, we're going to get did, there. I, Do you know? Well, go ahead. Yeah. Well, oh, you mean the 100 burpees? No, just like the fastest burpee in the game. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because no, I'd won the event at the 2022. Hold on, I got that coming up. Don't, oh, that's part. We're, we're gonna get there. We're gonna I actually got all the footage, Jake. Don't you worry. We're, we're gonna react to that first. Let's react to this clip. What did y'all think when you heard this? I was I, confused. It, it kind of came out of nowhere. <laughs> yeah, I've yeah. never spoken to him. I've I've never spoken to him either. I've competed against him at Rogue, which was in like it was the first Rogue Invitational, 2019. Yeah, but we didn't. I don't even think I talked to him in passing. Yeah. Yeah, uh, don't have anything against him up until now. But <laughs> um, well, how did it get but, sent to you? How did you find out about it? They tagged me in the reel. Oh, so yeah, it was like oh, he did. Ta he tagged yeah. me in the so, reel uh, too. Pedro, Coffee Bob Wad made a reel of this to get it popping. Yeah, and it was right before. It was that's why you didn't know Aunt Haynes was in it. Yeah, and it was just Colton. So here's what's in. Here, here's what I thought. I was like, Aunt Haynes, our boy's on there. Yeah, he's gonna step up for us. And nope. Yeah, <laughs> he didn't say yeah, shit. He's, he's on our team, right? Yeah. yeah. Well, he doesn't. Kyle didn't Ruth you coach, coach him? him last year at the game? Well, you, yeah, yeah. you, uh, you I didn't... stepped in as his yeah, coach. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Aunt, come on, dog. Yeah, you could have backed me up in here. <laughs> to be fair, Caroline was... did seem like she was uh, rolling her eyes at that. Comment. If it was me on there, I probably would have done all this. <laughs> did you watch? Did We're in the same shoes. Uh, the whole episode, most of it. Yeah. I didn't see. You. Did did Ant say anything after? Was he like, "Yo, dog, that's my team." I, I think eventually Colton asked him if he is TTT, and he says that he his brother was. Oh, okay. He he, he goes through the whole thing. Yeah, but he he doesn't say that's our. You know, yeah, he yeah. takes care of me. Yeah, he didn't yeah. do what he should have done. Yeah, but I would have cowered too. So. <laughs> did you listen to the like? Was there context for why? No, he this said came that? out of left field. So yeah. they were done with the whole. That episode. had to have been some pre. There's he had no to have known that I was going to be on it. Well, yeah, and then pre a, what he was going to say. There was a comment in the uh, on the episode that was like, "This man probably spent twenty minutes before <laughs> no, the episode yeah, practicing that for sure." Had a script, like the way he came up with Here's those names crazy. on the spot. Max, you can back me up for years since I've been here, twenty seventeen. Yeah, I, anytime we have you high level athletes, I'm always like, "Look, guys, I don't give a shit if you win. Just do me one solid. If you win a heat, do not mess up your <laughs> post win interview. Just yeah. do me that. Just be interesting. That's all yeah. I say. It's like you don't have to, just here's here's the thing." Don't answer their boring question. They're going to be like, eh, how'd you blah, blah, blah. You just say, nope, take the mic and just acknowledge the crowd. Do anything except for be boring. So I've said that. And now that we got someone in the sport who's not being boring and it's coming yeah. against us, I'm like, oh, this isn't how I wanted it. But yeah, finally. <laughs> yeah. But to your credit, Jake, you said something that was a little cocky and arrogant. I mean, it was true in the moment. It was true in the because moment. Yeah. Because you, you did at the time. Yeah, the workout. I mean, Should we just play it? Should, yeah. Okay. Well, play the clip how it started. I'm. I still. I feel like there's All more right, to so, react to in terms of like, 
I don't know if that was he was attacking me or he was attacking me saying that about Jake and attacking Jake. Well, that's but I guess it's thing. one in the same. None of now. us know. So yeah. we're all sitting yeah. here like, huh, where did that yeah. come from? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah. good on him. It was, it was pretty funny yeah. stuff. And then Savon said on his thing, he's like, well, Max, you took a big loss on this. I was like, that's like the equivalent <laughs> of a street fight of somebody like running down the road and punching you in the face and running away that you've never seen. Like it's not, it was a sucker like, punch. Yeah, yeah. There's no like rules of engagement there. It yeah. doesn't feel like a loss. All but, right. We might come back and yeah, say maybe. more about reacting to that, but uh, where did this all come from? He said, Max, you're crazy. Cause you said Jake had the fastest burpees in the game. But the question is, is why did you say that? Well, let's pull up the documentation. <laughs> oh, I look so different than <laughs> I do, do now. Right People right on the internet are probably like, is that the same guy? Yeah. Yeah. Right? This is uh, super Saiyan Jake. Yeah. I need to bring that back. All right, so this is my footage. I'm on the sideline here. Here we go. That part of the plan kind of went out the window, but I know I got the fastest burpees in the game, so if I could be, you know, top three going into it, I knew I would have won. So I know I got the fastest the burpees background. in the game, so if I could be, you know, top three going into it. <laughs> you like that yeah. one? Yeah, that's one of my favorite quotes of all time. Dude. I bring it up on the podcast because he really did it come out of nowhere in that workout. We're going to get into it. Okay, yeah. well, f crushed it and then just – came out with it and I was, yeah game. so i bring it up pretty much anytime i can yeah <laughs> yeah well that's what i was gonna say i mean i said it initially in the in the interview but you guys kept repeating it and it was more why so, it was we? it was more so like it became a joke yeah you know it wasn't like yeah like serious yeah but i guess it is now now you got to prove it yeah, here's why because you were the first person to say anything well not the first i'm sure there's things here and there that i'm forgetting about but the first person to say anything of note that was like in an interview so of course we're going to take well, it and run with it yeah i mean this was two years ago <laughs> who's who's out of all the interviews they've done in crossfit whose interviews I'm, are still resurfacing yeah hey that's a good <laughs> point can you think of any I know there has to be at least someone who said something. I'm just forgetting it. Yeah. But most people is just trash. It's just yeah. even Lex. I was like, come on, dude. Yeah, they're you, like, well, my strategy yeah, was this. Yeah, no one is a ten. And, but you gotta, yeah, you gotta make some noise. So I bet now people are gonna be. Oh, for sure. Yeah. Especially Colton. Yeah. We'll see, not only the fastest burpees in the game, but the best uh, post inter post workout interviews in the game too. That's the only one I've ever had, so <laughs> I'm bad in one thousand. You're one for one. It is like fighters or CrossFitters. If you're in the middle of that state and you have to leave an interview, people judge you as if you're like yeah. in normal mind, not at max heart rate. Like there's so much, you're so fired up yeah. at that point. But so yeah, here's what anyways. I'll this, this one wasn't like, a t like I wasn't like destroyed after like, I, you know, like my brain was still working, mm. you know, so I. No, none of that excuse. Hey, <laughs> I wasn't like wad drunk. Yeah. You know, but here's the thing. Everybody's going to be like, hey, look, you know, we have all this drama coming up. We're going to have the live stream, which is Wednesday at the live stream of them doing 100 yeah. for So time. you versus Colton is going to yeah. happen. Everyone's going to be like, look, all this happened because Colton popped off on Coffee Paws Wads. Well, kind of. Yeah. All of it happened because this dude <laughs> popped off two years ago at a semifinal. Yeah. And then we kept repeating yeah. it. All right, so let's see what happens. So right now we're going to play a clip. We're going to start mid-workout, and you're going to see that all these guys are doing – what is this, Toza Bar? Mm -hmm. yeah. Yep, and and you're going to see right here that Jake is um, – I forgot behind. what happens after this. So let's just watch this yeah. whole clip and see what happens. This is HQ's feed. You're all the way over there, right? Yeah. Yeah, Noah. Noah's off. Beat me by a lot. I mean, I'm and you're breaking. St you're still over there. Who's that, Saxon? Yeah. Saxon. No, that's Tyler. Oh, Tyler Christopher. Yeah. Then I, I Oh, yeah, went. you just yeah. came. You just so Noah was like three ahead of me by now. Four, three or four. You probably won't see me <laughs> for the rest of the clip. You won't. Like <laughs> that's what we're reacting to. They even said that, like, the announcer mentions, he's like, Jake Berman, but they never pan. But eventually, you're going to see they make a split, a split screen for Sager, I think. And then let's make sure we look at her. <laughs> Who is that? Who knows? Oh, that's uh, Noah's crowd. But where's Jake? I'm, you're literally oh, I'm not, not shown. I'm not, I'm not the box next to Noah. I'm the one. No, you're, yeah, yeah, you're, you're the farthest to the right. Yeah. Because I'm right, I'm right next to you, cheering you on and filming you. Man, I remember this, too. And so if I remember, there's going to be a split screen. And you're like, of course it'll be Jake. Of course, we'll put the leader right. But how could they even know? Like they, what do you mean they have counters? Don't they? I think yeah, they have counters not, on the side of the workouts. 
I mean, you could zoom out, right? I mean, they could just see my burpee speed was faster than everyone's, but I don't think there's any way for them to have known that I was t catching everyone. And or, there's or, no or, or that I was in the lead. All right, let's listen. Christopher fell, fell off. Oh, here's the split screen. <laughs> Still not in. Yeah. One left for Noah Olsen. And once again, Jake Berman's... <laughs> oh! <laughs> and they didn't have a camera on you. They knew oh, there he, there you and go. Then, hey, he's at the top right. <laughs> or top left. And then let's pan to the other guys. Oh, okay. Let's go. That was a fun moment. What do you do? You like relive the moment when you watch yourself do that like that? No, I mean, not really. No. Do you remember it? Yeah, yeah, I remember. What? What? That it wasn't was cool. the last like my workout. Dad was, was like it? at the finish line. It was cool. Was that workout that was the, five? That was, workout that was five? the second to last. So that yeah. pushed me into like contention. Yeah, yeah. That mm. was crazy. Yeah. I mean, so when yeah, you watch this back, is it kind of a bummer, bittersweet that you can't see your execution that? Your moments not counting. No, I mean, <laughs> I got the interview. So, yeah. Yeah. But yeah. The well, memory is I, saved forever. I have a cool picture of hugging my dad at the finish line. Oh, nice. And I framed it and gave it to him on Father's Day. Oh, that's oh, awesome. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. And then Colton called you out. Yeah. <laughs> well, here's the thing. Here's the good news is that your boy was on the sidelines oh, you got filming it. you the whole time. So while oh. HQ can't do their job, <laughs> you got your boy right there. Here we go. Let's see how it actually looked. Oh, this is good footage, too. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get your ass either. <laughs> you just had him passing through. <laughs> oh, let's play yeah. Did you see the edit? Yeah. yeah, let's play it one more time. Oh, there's you and your dad. I really uh, thought you were about to have. <laughs> yeah, so no. <laughs> hold on. <laughs> watch, watch, watch. He just Here rolls comes. back. Listen, listen. Oh, that's a hunch. No holes, no holes. <laughs> yeah, that's what I had, boys. Yeah, you got a little wow. bit of your head popping you through the screen. Which, send me that? <laughs> yeah, I'll send it to you. Yeah. What's crazy is I filmed ninety percent of him most of the workout because I think Noah had a camera guy that day, so I was like, I'll film Jake, you know. Yeah. And then last shot, I was like, let me let me get Noah winning this. Thing. Yeah. Did you think Noah was winning? Well, yeah, because I'm. I yeah. mean, I dude, I'm barely. I'm just trying to stay in focus, and I'm yeah. listening to the guy, and he's screaming Noah. So I'm like, all right, Noah. Yeah. 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 I never doubted you for a second, sir. I did. In the moment, I did. And I was like, holy shit, he came out of nowhere and yeah. won. And then you dropped the line. Like, that whole experience for me will be, like, yeah. that was a strong fun. memory in my brain, which but, is why I bring it up on the podcast. Yeah. Not, like, we didn't know it was about to get better with the with the interview. Yeah. Yeah. It was special, especially going, like, one, two with Noah. Yeah. We've done that in quarterfinals. Yeah. In yeah. The world. Both it's, of you. It's at, always. Yeah, go ahead. Fun. Sorry. I no, cut no, you off. No, you're good. Noah missed his jerk in the complex and he was like he wasn't out of the cut line but he was like mm -hmm. fighting all weekend and you were making a charge at the end of the weekend yep. so you guys finishing one two was like all we right cool that. it set it up like you, that's what we needed to happen it was like the perfect did your camera not turn on the whole time uh -uh. oh no <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> you have the audio of this shit <laughs> with no camera <laughs> you have the recording of this screen though don't you you're, oh my god! Is he joking? I don't think so. I, based on that fucking reaction, why are we gonna react again? <laughs> we can't do that again. You have it on audio. You could just put up. We had technical difficulties and play the screen and me. your face. I have me. Probably. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Make fun of me or something. All right, let's react to Chris wow. fucking his job up. Right. Hey, hey I, I when you do your day. coffee pods and wise, you could tell them how professional your your editing Ladies is. All the time. gentlemen, look, we got Jake Berman. <laughs> <laughs> we got Max Hodge. All right, hey, we had a moment of truth just a second ago where I was like, "Hey, I didn't turn the camera on. I just noticed," and we was like, "Do you do it again?" And there's just no way we yeah. can react to this shit again. It won't so. be authentic. Yeah. We're like 20 minutes in. Whew. So uh, we're going to show so. your face. We're going to play the audio. Yeah. And you're going to show. We're going to have all this beautiful was... footage on. Thank God yeah. we have stuff to look at. Yeah. But the whole point was to see your face. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> all right. Well, we got more, boys. <clears throat> show us at this So point. this was posted by our boy. Fun fact. I can do 100 burpees over this 300-pound hog. Faster than Jake, we do them over a barbell. See you next week. 
What's your reaction to that? Well, that's by the way, a hundred percent not true. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, where the pig moves? Yeah, where they have to hold the pig on both sides. I remember your first reaction was just like, "Do it." Yeah. That uh, my first reaction is that pig is three hundred pounds. Uh, that doesn't look like a three hundred pound animal, does it? I don't know. Yeah, <gasps> thinking back now, I probably should have said I have the fastest burpee box getovers in the game because that was the. That was it the was movement. A, yeah that was the movement. Should we change? Should we when Do you we get on it? Savan tomorrow? You like, should be like, hey, it doesn't slap. We're doing it burpee box get over. It doesn't it doesn't roll off the tongue. <laughs> yeah, it's just it's not as clean. Why did you? But if I. Do the burp. Never mind. In the comments, you said 100 bar facing burpees for time. And that's how this whole thing turned into a thing. Yeah. Yeah. No, I was just like, all right, let's settle it then. Fucking I'm not going to just let this be an Instagram war. Like, let's <laughs> yeah. fucking. Let's do let's it. So the crazy off. thing is, is <laughs> I'm like, okay, all right. So I got to come in here and let's like gear up and let's promote this thing. And then the next day we come in and I'm Jake's training and I see him and he kind of starts getting a little quiet and he's like hovering over his phone. And I don't know what's happening. And then you had, what, that day you got a MRI texted to you or something like that, an x-ray, or what happened? Well, so, yeah, like, circling back to the last open workout, I hurt my knee. And I hadn't been able to squat in, like, a couple weeks. And then I had scheduled an x-ray, or I scheduled an appointment with an ortho for that Thursday, the day after this came out. The day Um, after his trash talk came out. Exactly, yep. And... So that Thursday, I found out that I have, like, small fractures in my tibia and uh, arthritis and then had an MRI for later that day, and we're getting the reading the next day. So then fast forward to Friday, doc calls me, says, hey, you have a full tear on your meniscus, need surgery. Um, Let me know what you want to do. And you had already scheduled the 100 burpees. Yeah, so it was was definitely a weird time for me because I had already agreed yeah. You know, I put it out there like, all right, let's settle this hundred <laughs> bar facing. And I could do burpees on this. Like it doesn't hurt it that bad. And But you're yeah, thinking about your season. Yeah, and also thinking about the season. So I said, Doc, like how can I potentially get through the next couple of weeks? How can I start squatting? And I got quarterfinals. And he's like, We can try quarter zone. It's like, all right, let's do it. And he's like, I can get you in Tuesday. And I'm like, Well, I gotta do this burpee thing <laughs> this burpee Wednesday. Because it was originally scheduled for last week. Right. Yeah. yeah. So I'm like, can you get can you get me in any sooner? He's like, we can do Monday. It was Easter weekend, so no one can do it over the weekend. So, and he said I have to stay off the leg for like four days after. It was really stiff. So, did you get yeah, shit for it for changing? No, it? I I messaged them you, and yeah, they, were they, they were both oh, cool. Okay, with it. cool. Yeah, they were both cool. With it. Nice. It's a cordial was, remote yeah, shit. I was talk. transparent. Yeah. I was like, hey, this is this is what I'm going through. Um, you know, if you was want there me, any thought of just saying fuck it, I'm not doing it. Uh. I mean, yeah, but I, you know, I don't want to bail. Yeah, lot, there's a lot of hype built up, and people people think I'm copping out. Like yeah. it'll make me look so bad. I was when and, if you were gonna pull out, I was gonna have to phone a friend and call Noah and be like, "Can you please yeah, do this race?" Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, they they met Barbell. defend our honor because I can't myself. <laughs> yeah, they messaged me this morning, and they were like, "Hey, like, how's your knee?" I'm like, "Not good. Probably not competing this year." Mm-hmm. And they're like, "Well, are you still good to do the burpees?" I'm like, "Yeah, I'm not gonna bail. Yeah, like, let's go." Damn, let's do it. So you pick bar facing, and then you put out a I post. I did. Well, so it's <laughs> you did a post <laughs> so too. JR, so Jr. You know Jr. Hell. Yeah. He texted me the same day. It was probably like thirty minutes before this podcast came out, or before we saw the clip. And he said, "Hey, what's your fastest hundred bar facing?" And I was like, "Why? Are you like, are you about to do it?" He's like, "No, I'm just curious." So I told him my time. And then the reel came out like 20 minutes later. I'm like, oh, that's why you're asking. Uh, and, oh. and then I was just thinking, all right. He must well, have known. They JR? probably told or he, well, or he was watching it live. On it live. Was, I think he was watching it live. Yeah. And that's yeah, why yeah. he asked. Or he was on his own podcast with Savon. And I just think like bar facing is like the easiest standard to, you know. Yeah. I think just get over j- the bar. Yeah. It's just, you know, there's no hearsay. And then um, I think 100 is a good like rep count like it's you know between three and four minutes if you're going really fast and it's a good time domain Sub three maybe <laughs> that way people aren't watching burpees for 10 minutes you know it's better for spectators and test capacity test power test yeah. burpee speed so i think it's the perfect number so did you have any thoughts on colton before this were you a colton fan did you know much about him i mean i i don't know him personally yeah, but yeah. yeah i'm a fan like I, I mean not a fan but yeah yeah you're i not a fan, i no. respect him like he is, he's made the games a bunch of times. I've never made the games. I don't really have much room to talk here, but um, you know, but I'll do you know, I'll burpee off against him. 
<laughs> That's not weird, Birdie. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I mean, it's I, just an interesting I concept. Just, shit talking applied to head to head CrossFit. It, it feels it feels weird for me to shit talk him because he's like the multiple games athlete, mm. and I've never made the game. You're so the so underdog, I, right? Yeah. yeah, I've been very close. I yeah. don't think you can get closer than I've been <laughs> multiple times. But what wasn't it the year from that clip? Didn't you? Weren't you like a yeah, yeah point sixth, or two? right? I Last missed, chance. I missed it by a spot. So they take top five at semifinals, which debatably the hardest region in the world i got sixth and when it came down to it i know there's like so many different things in every event but when it came down to it was like the last lunch step it was one lunch step between me and spencer and then they still had the last chance qualifier that year so i went to the last chance qualifier and it's like 30 right and they take 30 and they take two yeah they take top two and i got third <laughs> so oh. Do you got to do the back to me. Bring the whistle. Oh, I, that hurts too much to do the whistle. You know the whistle? The stone cold whistle? No. You never seen him get in the ice bath? <laughs> we oh, should have it is. Yeah, we should have brought that's that pain. up. Uh, all all right. right. Well, moo. No, that's not Colton Mar- Martin's farm. <laughs> that's the noise for our flashback segment. Jake, you look pumped. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's bring up our first reaction. <laughs> Bam! What the fuck is this? <laughs> oh my god, that's, that's you? Me. What do you mean, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Damn, you want to be day a, one. Oh, oh my god. Once, huh? How, old How old are you here? Yeah. How old are you? 13. Damn. Why and don't you wear glasses anymore? I contacts. Oh. Yeah. I've leveled up. I've glowed up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Clearly. What was your training like back then? Classes? That's a, what, is that a 10 pound kettlebell? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> five, pounds, five pounds? <laughs> 10 pounds might be generous. Dude, you don't a, even look like the same person. Yeah. Well, I mean, he's 13. It's because yeah. I didn't have blonde hair yet. I guess, yeah. So why did you get but, into CrossFit? What are you doing here? Um, So my dad's girlfriend at the time was like a marathon runner. Excuse me. And I th- her friend was a was a coach at this gym. This is CrossFit East Cobb. Mm. And this is one of the first gyms in Atlanta. And this is back in... 2009? That's crazy. 2009. Oh, nine. Man, we got into CrossFit nine. at the same time. And yeah, you're all three of us. 10 years younger than me. It's crazy. Yeah. My body's paying for it. <laughs> My training age is high. Yeah. A lot of wear and tear. But yeah, so that's how I was introduced to this gym. And I, th- I, I this is one of the first classes I took for sure. Like you were just in the yeah. classes. How old were you here? 13? 13, yeah. And just taking classes? Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Your I was, dad was, I was taking ready, with you? I was getting ready to go into high school. So I was, um, now this might be seventh grade, summer going into eighth grade. But, you know, I, I'm training for, trying to get bigger, faster, stronger for football, high school sports. And I was getting really into working out. And my dad was like, you should come try this CrossFit training stuff. It's like, back then it was like, everyone looked at it as military yeah. style boot camp. And I was super down with it. So i Went to a class and never looked back. Mm. <laughs> no, for real, we, though, we, we talked about it on the on another podcast. Yeah, we did. How we, yeah, we talked about your whole story. My, yeah. yeah, like yeah. the long story short, I yeah. got a, arrested and expelled in middle school and had to go to alternative school. Yeah, that's crazy. And it was, yeah, it was just like this this shopping set. Like this school was far from where I lived, and there, so I had to get dropped off at a bus stop, and the closest bus stop was in the shopping center that happened to have a CrossFit gym. Like, what are the odds of that? It was, it was all bleeding. That to was a this great episode. Moment. So if you Mitten want after stars. this, go go listen to Jake Berman. Just type in Corpus Anus Podcast. Yeah, yeah. Jake Berman, you'll Jake, find Jake it. Jake German, Corpus <laughs> Anus. <laughs> all right. Well, let's uh so eventually you end up gearing up and it looks like you start competing. Mm-hmm. Where are we at here? Was it Garage Games? Oh it was my Garage God. Games. Yep. Zoom in again. It really doesn't even look like you to me. Yeah. Oh, okay. I see it a little bit. I see we've switched from Nike to uh, Under Armour. I'm clashing so many brands in this. Like, <laughs> oh, we got Nike. Adidas. Adidas shorts. Damn, I love when people rock all the brands at once. <laughs> Remember the Nike free runs? Oh, snap. This Where was this competition? I think Dahlonega. Yo, remember Travis when Garage was probably there. Remember when Garage Travis Games gave out the uh, Zigzag Nanos? You remember those? What's a yes. Zigzag Nano? They basically, Reebok, when they first signed the deal, they had a whole bunch of Zigzags in there. You remember Zigzags? No. Oh, I don't know how to explain it. The bottoms were all crazy. Oh, they're like waves yeah, yeah. on them? It was like okay. a gimmick. Yeah. But it, like football players were wearing them or stuff. And they must have just not sold any. So when they made the first CrossFit shoe, they just slapped a CrossFit tag on those and were like, here, give them away for free. Those really? were the Nanos? Actually, no, they, they weren't CrossFit. Nanos. Oh, okay. They were just the first thing that had Reebok CrossFit on them was those. Oh. Yeah. 
Yeah. I forgot that Reebok and CrossFit like co-branded those original apparel deals. Yeah. And what's crazy is that original like Delta logo was the Reebok CrossFit logo. And then eventually Reebok said, no, this is just the Reebok logo. Yeah. And then they went back, blah, blah, blah. How, how yeah. old were you in this one? It's hard to say. Maybe 14 or 15. So, so this is like I a year or two after the original picture? Yeah. So I basically, you know, finished out middle school at this alternative school, going to CrossFit every day for hours till my you know, dad picked me up and mom picked me up. And I, you know, I started off obviously with like banded pull-ups and 10 pound kettlebell swings, as you saw in that one pick. And then eventually started to RX workouts and I'm like, okay. And then these local comps started popping up as CrossFit was growing. So I went on this like competition tour mm. with the garage games. Cause it was big in the Southeast and that was like the thing to do in the right. off season. Um, you're just and in the just, division, though. That's a dude behind you, like a that's an older <laughs> dude, right? I'm just, I'm in a I think scaled here. Oh, I didn't okay. I didn't I couldn't do an RX competition. <laughs> that for a that few is years. just a dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, that. But was I a, remember seeing Travis at some of these because I, I mean I was doing them all the time. These competitions were popping up everywhere. Um, I don't know what this one is, but they had like Integrity's Revenge. Yeah. Um, Survival of the Fittest. That was actually my first competition. Survival of the Fittest. Which was at that gym in the woods in Woodstock. Yeah, you know, they the used to have these all Dude, the everyone, time. What do you think of it? Do you have any thoughts on that? Like, what happened? It, maybe I just don't see it anymore. But has the local competition being taken serious faded? Or is I it? think so. I think they just became bigger. I think there's just bigger local comps now, and yeah. there's not any of these like yeah. these ones were just kind of like people got together from yeah. gyms and just like threw them. Yeah, all but they were happening all the time. Yeah. All the time, like. JR CrossFit Crash, like he has a, a local competition that's inside his gym, but the whole field is like semifinals and games athletes. Yeah. Does so. he have any other one than the Crash? He has the Crash Crucible and then the the team one. I forgot the name of but it. Both but both of them are like elite like, people. Yeah. It's not like this was like anyone was yeah. showing up. Yeah, like this regular is, people at the gym would just this do this. Probably like twenty eleven. Yeah. Do you think it um, died with COVID? And, was it happening before COVID? No, I was, can't remember. I mean this was I feel like it died before died before back, that. Before yeah. That. Yeah. 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 I mean, I remember Brandon Phillips. Yeah, BP. He yeah. Was BP. He was he was winning all these competitions, and uh, Travis came in the game. Yeah, it was good times, man. We should should bring back garage games. You know those guys? No, I, I never met him. I knew or I met him long ago, but I don't. Didn't Travis have a or own like half of the gym, or he was like a coach there? Or? I think he was a coach at the was it, was it the garage? The garage. I think yeah. he was a coach there, or maybe he just worked out there. But then he moved on from there pretty early, I think. All right, well, let's look at our next photo. <laughs> Pretty similar, but looks like you stay competing. And the interesting thing to note here, Garage Games 2011 <laughs> oh, is on is. the shirt. Yeah. The interesting th thing to note here is the porta potties. So the, your bathroom <laughs> situation hasn't changed at all. Because <laughs> no, our porta potties are gone now. As of like yeah. yesterday. <laughs> yeah. So guys, from the, from the week before the open all the way through team quarterfinals, can't pee, yep. can't poo. We got <laughs> these porta potties. Dude, it's been a nightmare. Do you, so. do you know what actually happened? No. So there's the plumbing lines from the building out to the street. The landlord came here and they did this huge project where they cut open all of the concrete and they fixed our pipe from here to the road. Huge project, tens of thousands of dollars, made sure that it was graded properly, level, all the sediment was right. Two days later, it got plugged up again. So the city had to come out to fix it. Day one of the city fixing it, somebody fell off of a ladder and like cut their ear open and they have to shut everything down because they have like policies and they end up finding out there's a 10 inch um, pipe, drain pipe that goes from where they fixed into the city line. And at some point, AT&T came and they ran fiber optic cable, which is like a three inch pipe and bore it. And it bore straight through that pipe. Oh. So basically the water went pee and was going through, but like shit and <laughs> toilet paper was hitting that thing. And then eventually getting blocked up all the way at the street and then backing all the way up. Is here. that why our internet was down sometimes? <laughs> yes, maybe. And the freaking, the every time we can't fix shit the floor, pee, the internet's <laughs> broke too. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. Back to the Trifecta. photo. Yeah. What's happening here, Jake? Just still competing. I'm training for the porta potty Olympics. Yeah. <laughs> did you, did you ever I win became, any of these things? I eventually did when, um, I think uh, just like a regular RX years later. How old were and then you? I, and then do you remember Rumble by the River? No. In Columbus? 
No. So they oh, is a, that the one that Travis and Mike went to as a part of a team? Oh, I went Maybe, to that. But there was a rumble by the river in one year that was like the most savage competition. Like, because it was all outside in July oh in Georgia. And we're doing like hero workouts oh on God. concrete. <laughs> so I remember the last work. I think my back's still messed up from this workout. Um, Cause I did the RX and I'm competing with like Brandon Phillips and Irving Hernandez yeah. and the all Inga, the Southeast Ingham brothers and the, those guys. Um, the, the Anderson brothers too. The Anderson brothers, In, In, Chase Ingham, Ingham, Ingham or, Jason and Jason and yeah. Josh or something. Oh yeah. Yeah. Jason yeah. and Josh. I was thinking Chase Ingram, not Ingram, those oh, guys, yeah. but the Anderson brothers too were yeah, around here. Yeah. All so, three of them, right? Yeah. There's like five of them. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know keep that. Coming. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that was crazy. We did the hero workout McGee. I don't know it's that one. It's a 30 one. minute AMRAP of five deadlifts at 275, 10 push ups or nine push ups, and then 15 box jumps. Oh and, my and God. And we're doing push ups on the concrete. It's like so hot. hot. I, the deadlifts are like max effort for me at this time. I weigh like 135, <laughs> you know? And breaking my, yeah, there it is. Breaking my back. Oh. Okay, 13 push ups and nine push ups. And that was just For 30 a minutes. End of the work. End and dudes of the are comp? getting like 30 rounds. Oh my God. No. I, no. I might have <laughs> no, got, I think you. I got like seven rounds, but I eventually came back to Rumble by the River and won. I think if. Um, after you beat Colton at 100 burpees for time, that should be the next workout you challenge him to. Yeah. <laughs> not really. All right. That's our, not a fun yeah, yeah. Speaking of winning, our final reaction here. We don't have to watch this whole clip, but here we go. Why? Wow, it's a minute. Damn. Got Jake Berman, CrossFit quarterfinals, first place. This song's getting me in the mood. Four. Damn. Looking oh, like a brown stallion bothered. with skates on. <laughs> Cranking out those reps. I could also I argue like edit. handstand push-ups oh, in, yeah. in the game as well. I'm sure you get somebody else to call you out. There's yeah. still time. <laughs> you That'll be next. Mix it up. Uh, so what happened here? There's a story here. This was, uh, you don't have a it story. in the edit, but Jake, I think Noah, Travis, and... Was there four of you guys on the wall? I feel yes. like there was yeah, one K more. Kyle Bernier. Maybe. Kyle B. We're on the wall, and you set the world record. You won, mm -hmm. and Noah was a couple of reps behind you. Travis was a couple of reps behind Noah. Mm -hmm. KB did pretty well, but he was a little bit farther behind. Yeah. You won, and we were like all pumped about it, and then you got a penalty for it. No, right? no, 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 no. I, I still have the record. You won that one? Yeah, I got a penalty and still won. No. Oh, that's gangster. Yeah. You got a major or a minor? I think it was minor. Noah got the same one. It was for uh, like the extension. Just for, just for no, no, no. It was the first rep of like picking the dumbbells up, and they said I didn't fully extend before I started my hand cleans. Uh, That's what it was. Uh, okay, so you ended up winning that workout yeah. overall in the world. Yeah, uh, even with a okay. penalty. Yeah, I told you to put that yeah, in here because okay. I thought that he got a penalty and lost the win. I got the penalty on the next year, or yeah, with a win, with a global no, win. A no, win. no, it, it was like third in the world, and then I got a penalty, and it. They, yeah. That was a major penalty. That was a cool. That was just a cool workout in quarterfinals. That was one of the first years of quarterfinals, just in yeah, general. That was the first and, workout. Yeah, a, and then I remember Noah, yeah. me and Noah, Noah. I think did get second in the world, right behind you. Yeah, yeah. So that's another one too. Yeah, with Noah and I. Damn, I remember damn. everybody was out there, and I was like, "I'm gonna pick Jake," and then you won. I was like, "Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> got that one." Yep. <clears throat> All right. Well, we're winding down. Jake sent us one clip to react to. Why are you giving me that look, man? Here we go. Blind corn? Can't hear it. Are you ready, Max? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you ready? <laughs> is that you playing? Is your first? No, oh, no, okay. no, no. It's like a middle school girls basketball game, and they they're running hey, that's out to a, that's gangster. They're running out to corn. <laughs> but why? Why is this, <laughs> this is a reacts video? Because Jake's a big corn fan. You remember, uh, okay. remember that video? Oh, is this a corn shirt? Yeah. Oh, it is. I got that Chris for Jake. Got me this. Oh, nice. Yeah. What is it? What is a corn? A reference to like actual corn? Like you don't want to know why they name their band? I corn. do want to know. Nope. Google it. <laughs> 
Why? For a different oh, one. we can't put it on the podcast? <laughs> yeah. All right, fine. I'll let you figure it out. <laughs> but yeah, we made a video years ago where it was like Jake listening to corn. I don't remember. It was the, it I think was, if you look up F. Travis like, Mayer. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. It was an open, I do remember that. that. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was a like subplot. Watch, yeah. watch Jake do this open workout to corn. Oh, no. The, we've done two corn videos now. Three. <laughs> so uh, why'd you pick this clip, Jake? I just think it's gangster. Where'd you find these, it? My friend sent it to me on Instagram. Oh, uh, okay. It reminds uh, me. It's just funny that this middle school girls basketball team <laughs> just runs out at the end. Like, <laughs> it just, I don't know. Is there cursing and shit in corn music? Oh, yeah. Okay. It's uh, like hardcore or hardcore? I love corn. Yeah. They're not. Yeah. I mean. Are you looking at me like I'm like <laughs> a space corn. head? It's always playing here. Maybe. What's I knew that song like, but I don't know what they would say in it. It just sounds like something takes a pop <laughs> or a boom, knock, oh my name, my name. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't sound like words to me. Yeah. Uh, sometimes that's all you need. Yeah, you, need you know, so that, to sounds. me that would be like fine. Teenage girls coming out to that, all good. They should do walkouts for CrossFit. They, they should, yo. Like hey, that. what about for uh, you and Colton? Yeah, well, he can come out to George Strait and we can hit you with some Dude. corn or something. I don't know. What Live you, streams weird. I wish we could do it head to head in person. Yeah. yeah. How is but it going to logistically work? I have no We're idea. We're just going to have a camera on them. They said, it's and just you're going to hook it up to a yeah. live stream. Did you yeah. talk to them? Yeah. Yeah. It's just I don't know. Like I'm not going to know where he's at. You know, I'm just going to have to. I mean, I the could liner zone. I could go. watch his. And yeah, but it might be on a delay. Be delayed. Your yeah. own pace, or yeah, yeah, yeah. And just see by his cadence. But yeah, that, yeah, that does kind of suck. But hey, you know what? We'll we'll make do. That that just cues it up for the the rematch. Yeah, in <laughs> reality, it's probably some random dude in Europe. That's yeah. faster than both. Yeah, there's truth hurts. Yeah. for sure. Uh, for sure. But you know what this video reminds me of though? Right here at the end. Noah, 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 no! Oh, there goes Jake. <laughs> <laughs> that was uh, a good edit. I mean, you just don't expect like a middle school girls team to be out listening to, to corn. I mean, yeah. that is, that's money. All right. Well, I definitely failed my job today. Anything else we want to wrap up with? <laughs> was here, that boys? all? You had all these videos in there. What are those? Do you nope. have any more? No, that was it. That was it for today. What Once you got th- anything else you want to pop up? I know that tomorrow you're what going you on talk about? Sevon. I am, yeah. Yeah. What do you think he's going to ask you? Um, are you going to be cold in the yeah. burpees? You think know. it's all going to be just like a hype match? I know. We'll probably, we'll probably shoot the shit. Yeah. I don't know. Sevon's pretty cool. Why do you think he called me out? Do you think he called me out I, to call you out? I think, no, I think he genuinely thought like you guys were crowning me as the fastest burpeer. I don't think he knows about that, I, that I said it. Yeah. It seems like harsh so. words to call someone an abomination for saying that somebody that they like has a yeah. faster burpees. <laughs> no, no, you no, abomination. No, 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 no. going to end my life. <laughs> no, me, forget but. all that. The, you know, all the harsh words. That's not the stuff that, you know, that that's all just fake, whatever, yeah. you know. Training, training, think to yeah, corpus yeah. anus. The one that like hurt me for you was when it was like, "Hey, you have a max on." Why? Why? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, "Damn, this dude is cold as a mug." Yeah, I thought it was just gonna end there, yeah. and then he went on his rant that yeah. he yeah. practiced. Before. Well, I thought I was like, "Well, you are listening to me if you know that I said that." Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> anyways, That's good though. Yeah, it should be a fun uh, experience. I'm hopefully, looking forward to it. Yeah, hopefully Colton loses. There's nothing I can really oh, do about that would it. That would be so sweet. You oh. got this, brother. I'm doing it for you. He's calling you out. He's calling my team out, taking shots. I'll the be tank. there. Yeah, I'll be there. Not the tub, but the tank. Come if on. I yeah, yeah, if I were to wear an appropriate pre-fight like corner man outfit, what corner would it be? man? Yeah. Did you say corn? Corn. Like your corn in there? <laughs> um, Are we gonna play corn while you go? wear a tuxedo? <laughs> Fuck man, all right. I will. Dude, I'm gonna wear a tuxedo top with top shorts. <laughs> <laughs> and a bucket hat. That's amazing. All right. All right. Good. What? In this is Let's get it. Hop off a 16 passenger. This a G5. No, this not a challenger. Big one. I keep some members with me in the fridge. The coat seats, they some cannibals. Eaters. They like to geek, geek. Drink a whole bottle, wake up and repeat. Damn. She took a look, Shh. mixed it with the chill out. Now she say she said 3D. Wow. I go in the jungle and they got a coat. I bet I come out with a meme. I bet I do this shit for the fam. Cause this shit bigger than me. Big. Color stones in my infinity link. And in the factory masterpiece. Factory. I call on twin, could that be my brother? We got the same roller, he matching me. Nah. For real, water on me like the sun. Of sun, carrot, sun, pointers. Ooh. All these commas, I won't fun from me. Go gunners out the jungle. We buy it all, fuck a front of nigga. Cake on me, no fun of cash. Drop top, feeling like stunning. Drop top, can't be play no runner. We gon' chrome my wallet, Ooh. smoke my pilot. Ooh. Take three, buy 
to the trappies. Trappy.